All right, this is Mike with Trek with Mike, Texas. We're here riding at night. Oh, it's about 5 a.m. Uh, middle of summer. Well, not the middle. It's the beginning of summer. It's the end of June. And, uh, you know, I'm riding at night. So let's talk about riding at night. Uh, let's just go over some disadvantages. Uh, it's harder to see. Uh, you need good lights. It's harder to be seen. You need good lights. Filming the camera just sucks at night. Um, grainy and you know, the Insta X3, Insta360 X3 camera just, you know, it's not a good night camera, period. Um, uh, definitely get some clear eye protection if you're riding at night. Uh, Simply because it's always a good idea to have eye protection, but the little bugs that are out and they're attracted to your bright light that you know you need to have, they kind of fly right into your face. And so that eye protection is nice in that regard. <clears throat> So what else is a disadvantage? Well, oh, you have to get up early. Well, I'm an early riser anyway, so to me that's not a factor. Uh, that just gives me something to do when I get up. And, uh, you know, other people, that might be a factor. So you can put that in either column depending on you. Advantages to riding early in the morning. So, it's a lot cooler. Um, you know, in the summer in Texas, it's a lot cooler riding at this time of day than it is later in the day. Upper 70s to 80 versus, you know, 95 to 100 or more. Let alone the sun's beating down on you. Uh, fewer people to contend with on the trails. There's not as many walkers, although I do see a few, even this early. Uh, Walking, jogging, walking the dog. So, there are some. <clears throat> so you have to watch out for them because they're not always as easy to see. Oh boy, here's a, another hazard. They'll run the sprinklers. They'll run the sprinklers usually overnight, early in the morning. And so, that's a hazard that I have to contend with in my neighborhood. And then the puddles that go along with it, which is just, say, look, look, at, look at all this water. Uh, looks like it's rained. Well, no, it's the sprinklers. And uh, the entire street's wet. They don't got these sprinklers aimed right. But that's that's the, your argument for fenders, right, people? <clears throat> so I've got a quarter mile stretch of street that's nothing but water. Even though sprinklers are already done here, and uh, my fenders are keeping the water off of me. 
to other advantages. You see, I'm on a street right now. <clears throat> Very few cars. In my neighborhood, I might see two cars before six o'clock on the weekends. Now, if it was uh, if it was a weekday before five is about the, the few cars that you would see at, at at between six and seven. The neighborhood's pretty alive with cars, and after seven, it's you know probably the worst time of the day to to ride a bike in the neighborhood is everybody's going to work. <clears throat> so. Well, the other other advantages is you get your workout in early. And then if you want to go later in the day, you still have that opportunity, right? So it's not a one time and you're done. Um, so I see a lot more wildlife out at, at night. A uh, couple stretches of this road, there's rabbits galore. I mean, so many rabbits. It's not even funny. But uh, you see them more, you know, this time of night than you do once the daylight hits. So there you have it. Now riding at night. Something that's uh, enjoyable. Don't be afraid of it. I kind of like it. Yeah, in Texas, <laughs> night, it's enjoyable in the morning, okay? If you go at 9, 10 o'clock at night, after the sun sets, it's still 95 degrees. <laughs> so, if you're beating the heat, that's not when to do it. So, thanks for watching.